NSFW, what is the weirdest fetish you've ever heard of? I'm sure there's weirder stuff out there, but I could never wrap my head around being into tiles. Like kitchen tiles. I hope Tile Guy is living his best life. The guy who likes to beep using his own beep as lubricant takes the cake. I can't unread it. I can't unsee it. I'm just glad I have a terrible memory. Beep crushing. Like, why the asterisk 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 asterisk? Ouch. This girl asked my friend to beep their raw chicken while she watched and wanted to eat it together, after he had beep in it and cooked it. Oh. I heard people secretly beep to random ass credit posts. Not me though. Boom. I've posted this before, but it's still one of the weirdest things I've ever been a part of online. Back in earlier days of the internet beep was definitely there, but it wasn't so ubiquitous. Well, I was a member of a sports-related site that had an off-topic message board. We discuss non-sports stuff there, and sometimes adult-related things were brought up. One dude gets on there and starts going crazy about trying to find this beep video he'd seen that really did it for him. Clearly, it really worked for his interests, but he couldn't find it anymore and it was killing him. He was acting like a junkie who couldn't get access to his stuff. Weird, but okay. Some people really like their beep, I guess. He asked us to help him find it. It was a video, he said, of one woman who was giving a beep asterisk 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 to two guys dressed as pterodactyls. Attack of the Flying Lizards starring Ashley Long. And there's actually three pterodactyls. That's amazing. Man it turns out my fetishes are W-A-A-A-Y-Y less weird than I thought. To be fair if you compare yourself to the ask reddit posts is like you compare your grade to the all, time lowest or all time highest grade records of the entire country. Putting light bulbs up there asterisk 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 crushing them and then proceed to pull out the glass, flesh and blood. Repeat. My starfish just puckered so hard I may not be for a week. Semporphilia, again of sexual pleasure from watching disasters as events. They would be having a beep of a time this year. Being loved by your so. Guys only want one thing and it's disgusting. My fiancé and I were about to couple swap with a lady and her husband. The lady was really hot and really into it. I was all for it. She said she'd just go get her husband. He was dressed as a giant baby. We no ped the beep out of there. Well I guess that answers why the lady was so into the idea of couple swapping. The one where women crush animals and fish various objects in high heels. Accidentally came across one on YouTube when I was like 14 and I'm still scarred. Okay enough reddit for me today. I used to work as a masseur and after a session one time, an older client offered me an extra $500 to flatten his beep like a pancake by stomping on it while wearing Doc Martin boots and cussing him out. He reassured me that he'd had it done before and that his beep asterisk would eventually return to its normal shape within a couple of weeks. When I said I wasn't gonna do it he then offered to have legally binding paperwork drawn up to ensure I couldn't be found liable for any permanent injuries caused to him. Needless to say, I didn't want to get involved and sent him on his way. You made the right call, that's not how contracts work. Being choked by a pair of huge badonkadonks. Some big ol' bonko nagahooks. Some honking bahonkers. Vorophilia. Once met a woman whose ultimate sexual fantasy was to be raped and set on fire. Here's a story for you. Me and a friend would try and find the most fucked up fetishists we could. Now I'm not one to judge what consenting adults get up to but I found a guy online who took the biscuit. He in his late 50s early 60s he had one arm, blind and one eye, missing half a leg and his remaining arm only had a couple of fingers and no genitalia. His fetish was that he wanted to have a woman remove his remaining limbs, blind him and deafen him. The photos he had uploaded were before and afters of his various missing appendages that he had cut off himself. He had used a knife on his genitals and fingers, had put one of his legs on a train track and lost his arm in a chainsaw accident, his vision was impaired with bleach. I can only imagine he got off on the idea of being a human nugget who is a burden to everyone around him. Sounds like let's say 90% mental disorder, 10% kink. I also found a woman online who got off on letting locusts eat her nipples. I don't know the name of that particular fetish but it is one. If you google it you can find her videos. I had a friend who, after dating a girl with herpes developed a fetish for herpes sacs. 
he got a sick kick out of licking Herbie's sores and sacks whilst going down on his sexual partners. He used to use those dating sites especially for people with herpes to meet more people to satisfy his needs. Dude was definitely riddled himself but said it never showed up on him. Beep AF haven't spoken to him in a couple of years now. This is the first one that I just can't believe. Beep cutting. See in a video where a gal slices her man's beep asterisk while performing some high class fellatio. Zero tense would not recommend. There's a guy in my state that keeps getting in trouble for his love of cranking. This is basically where you love the sound of a car trying to start and enjoy yourself inside the car while you turn the key. People that are into this usually take out the spark plugs so the car will keep on trying to turn over to no avail. The guy in question keeps running for office in Michigan and is a super evangelical Christian MAGA type. He breaks into other people's cars to do this. Till I live near the same town as someone who supposedly gets off to the sounds of a car starting. Two girls one cup. And I've seen it. I wish I haven't. Rest easy in the knowledge that it's actually fake. There's a bunch of actual poo beep out there but that ain't one of them. Oh thank god. People smelling women's asterisk 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 asterisk. That's the tamest beep here yet. Scat. Like that's dangerous. Do I wanna know what that is? Skittily do bop ta da wop. Vor is one of the strangest ones I've heard of. Nutting on figurines of anime girls. It's called hot gluing. I mean, our girl spooping is a thing that exists. I made the mistake of finding that out. Went on that subreddit, now I have the urge to bleach my eyes. Told you it was a mistake lol. This dude my old co-worker set me up with had a bug fetish. He said bugs crawling on him turned him on and he wished that this one kind of beetle was big enough, so he could sleep with it. He then showed me various photos of bugs. I know pet way he out of there. NGL I have never heard of a bug fetish until I met him. I hate bugs sad face. Maggot girl. Just. No. What is that? Guru edit seriously don't google this if you're at work. It's extremely grotesque violent hentai. Generally featuring beheading, torture, rape and general extreme violence towards women. Probably not the weirdest but some people j asterisk ck off when they think of cbs or other insects. Also, nebulophilia. Nebulophiles are aroused by fog. The human mind can be fascinating sometimes. Ah fog's pretty cool. I wouldn't beep to it but it is pretty cool. Well I don't know the name but whatever the beep goes on in our insects insects. Nobody needs to go on this subreddit. I didn't even make it halfway past the first post.